All right, uh, tough one there that came down to the end again. Uh, we got a lot of fight in us, but so does everybody else in this league. We have to minimize the mistakes and maximize the details to give us a chance to win these games. Let's open it up. What do you think? It, what do you think it is about the defense that it's been problematic through the last couple of weeks? They were able to drive right down the field when, when they needed it. Uh, again, we'll go back. We'll take a look at the film and uh, see what the film tells us. How disappointing is it though to see that happen to a defense that was one of the best in the league last year? Again, now? it takes all three phases. It's more than one drive. Um, but we need to go back, take a look at the film, and hit the details head on. Then what's the issue with the tackling? It seemed like that was a problem again. Yeah, we're not tackling fundamentally strong. We're, we're missing too many tackles. Way too many. We're not wrapping up well enough. What do you think is the disconnect between, like you're driving points home on a lot of these fundamentals. Where's the disconnect between that and it showing up in the game? And we're gonna again. We're gonna go take a look at the film. Uh, we're gonna work on our fundamentals in practice, and we need to do a better job coaching them up and getting them to show up on game day. How concerned are you about trying to keep this team together at 0-4? Oh, no, I'm not concerned at all. We have uh, talented men of integrity in a locker room. We have to stay to work, stay together. All we have is us. How do you convince them that? I know mathematically it's possible that a playoff berth is still in reach. That the season we is need still to win a damn game. Is Brad Wings still going to be your punter going forward? Yeah, Brad Wings our punter. He made one mistake today, right? A lot of guys made one mistake, including me. Why do you think there's been so many drops? Wide receivers catching That's a good the ball? question. They catch the ball for a living. We need to do a better job catching the ball. Is it surprising that with this group, I mean, it's not like you have young yeah, guys yeah. or? No, it's, yeah. you can get in the slump. How do you get him out of it? Catch it better. Work on it. Man, how surprised are you that you're sitting here the first day of October and you're Yeah, I'm not surprised. I'm not shocked. You know, you can't carry things over from one year to the next. We talked about that in the offseason. You got to be hungry. You got to be willing to work. And we need to get back to work as a staff and back to work as a team. Find a way to improve. That being said, even though there's no carrier, you have to. Have to be surprised at the talent on this team. That you're on. Yeah, I'm not, I'm not surprised. I'm not shocked. Disappointed. Irritate, irritated. How deflated after the turnover on downs, your defense got to have a 54 second three and out drive, <coughs> a critical drop, I think, in the second three, well ahead of the sticks. Again, it's not just one drive, it's not just one play. We need to do fundamentally, we need to do things better. We need to catch the ball better. Um, you know, blocking. Uh, we, we took a step in the run game today, I thought. Uh, I thought Goldman gave us some juice there from the backfield. Uh, but tackling uh, continues to show up on defense. We need to tackle better. We went into that the decision hard, long, long point here, but, but shouldn't you be surprised and shocked that you're 0-4? I'm irritated that we're 0-4. But we need to go to work. That's how you fix it. What did you, when is the decision to activate Wayne and given that playing time? Just, uh, you know, he was the second healthy back we had. The other guys worked through uh, worked through the week and did what they could. Uh, so we made that decision today, an hour and a half before kickoff. You passed up a field goal in the first half, the field goal attempt at least. What was the decision-making process there? We were right on the, right on the border there. It was, it was challenging to handle the ball. And uh, I thought we had, a, we had a good call and a makeable fourth down attempt. You lose in these tight games. Uh, do you, do you regret at all not at least taking the chance to put points on the board when you have that opportunity? To, Again, we, we look at each uh, each decision, and uh, if, we, if we felt it was best to kick the field goal there, we'd have kicked the field goal. But you know, the decisions early in the game, the game changes with the decisions that, that you make. The game, the game changes. One more. Why don't you throw a Hail Mary at the end of the first half or try to run another play? You have 12 seconds at the 40-yard line. 12 seconds at the 40-yard line. That was a, uh, a situational decision at the end of the half. Rather not have to punt in that situation. How surprised are you? How shocked are you to be in this position right now? Going for? Um, yeah, I mean, yeah, it's surprising. Uh, you know, I thought, you know, still have a good team, uh, doing some good things. It's not, not uh, quite making enough plays to win the game. And uh, in, in this league, uh, you got to earn it. You got to earn every win. It's not easy, and 
you know, you got to play good football. And we're, you know, we're doing some good things, but just not not playing uh, well enough to win the games. How demoralizing is it to lose back to back like that? I'm that's tough. You know, it's tough, it's tough to lose uh, two games in a row on uh, on field goals, on uh, kind of walk off field goals. So, um, you know, that's uh, uh, you know tough situation to um, have to lead and feel like you know doing some good things, get you know uh, have a good you know drive to go uh, take the lead, but obviously um, you know have a two point conversion and then get it get it re- reversed. So, uh, tough situation right there. You know, the, the long one, the Odell there on that last drive. Tell me about that one. Yeah, uh, just a um, little double move um, off of safety, and uh, he ran a great route, and uh, he'll put it on for, for a big play. So, um, you know, he went got that one. So, uh, you know, big play on, uh, in the game right there, a second and long, and, you know, to take a shot and to hit it was, uh, was nice. And a touchdown to Ellison. Yeah, uh, just had a little goal line play, and, um, you know, tried to hit, uh, you know, maybe Evan on a corner route, but you know, kept rolling and, and had had Red just, uh, you know, working, you know, working behind me, and uh, he'll get the touchdown, get the lead. Uh, you know, nice, nice drive right there. Did you know Odell had stepped out of bounds on the two-point conversion? Or? No, I didn't. I didn't know. You know, that's always always kind of a danger when you're working the back end line, and uh, you know, I was kind of looking looking at my back, looking at my tight end, just saw him working the back line, and 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 you know, give him a shot. You as a team leader, mm-hmm. kind of deal with this situation in sending a message to your team. Yeah, you know, you just keep uh, you keep fighting, you keep fighting for a win, and that, that's all you do every week. You, is every week you keep you prepare, you go out there, and you, and you try to get a win. And uh, you know, that's it doesn't you know each week it doesn't matter. It, you know, the record doesn't matter. You, you just want that feeling. You want that feeling after the game that you did something that you earned the win, uh, that your preparation was good, and you. Uh, came together as a team and found a way to, to, to get that feeling. So, hey, we, we need it, uh, we, we want it, and you know, nothing, nothing's going to be given to us. You're not just going to go out there and, and get wins. you got you to go out there and play good football. After what's happened the last two weeks in the final play of the game, you begin to worry when that first one's ever going to come? No, you don't, you don't worry. You just prepare and, and um, prepare to get it the next week, and that's all, that's all you can do. Your, your scramble for the touchdown, you go over there. Yeah, uh, had, had play, play action, tried to hit Brandon uh, back in the end zone. They played it, they played it well. Um, you know, kind of looked at, at Roger Lewis for a possible check down, and then um, you know, kind of working Brandon maybe on a scramble drill. But um, you know, saw, saw a window and uh, able to get the touchdown right there. So nice, uh, you know, big play at, at the moment. How agonizing is it standing on the sideline with three and a half, three minutes to go, with the lead, and then? Yeah, um, you know that's just that's football. You know, these, you know, uh, you go, you give a team enough time. Uh, you know, you get a good, good quarterback and a good team, good offense, and you know, they find ways to make make plays. So, um, you know, just just hoping you'd have another opportunity, or you know, defense makes a gets interception, tip ball, a sack, fumble, something, um, you know, to, or make them, um, you know, that's that's uh, stop on fourth down. So. Uh, you know, just uh, defense. Yeah, they, they they competed. They did some great things. Um, you know, we got to help them out. Try to get them a lead earlier uh, in games. We're, we're you know, playing from behind too much. What's Ben's message to this team right now? Um, you know, we just got to stick together. We got we to you know, keep keep working. We got to be pay attention to the details and, and find ways to play better football. And that's that's the way it comes down to. We got we got to play better. Um, and we got to you know just. Uh, you know, ways, you know, to, to get away. He, he said he wasn't <clears throat> shocked or surprised that he no longer four. He was more aggravated. How would you describe your feeling? Yeah, just uh, uh, yeah, just just uh, I don't know what the word is. I mean, just uh, you know, fr- yeah, frustrated. Uh, I guess in a, in a sense that you know, feel like we're doing doing some good things or just. Uh, but just not not playing our best football, right? and you see it. You know, you can tell it's out there on drives. We're leaving some plays out there, and um, you know, it's just it's not one person, it's not one thing, it's not one group. It's just everybody kind of you know has their part in that, and uh, that's what that's what good teams find a way to, to overcome those and, and you know make plays and, and create the moments in one game. One more. Not for, not related to the game and the outcome, but your pass protection seemed about as good as it has been all year. Did you have the time to set up more in this game? Yeah, I thought, 
I thought we did a good job. Uh, offense line did a good job. I think early on, they, you know, uh, McCoy was kind of in there. He's a good player. Uh, but I think, uh, you know, we got settled and um, and uh, pass protection was good and had, had time to, um, you know, go through the reads and, and scramble around a few times and, and make some plays.